I think people heard I got a feeling a few times, yes. And, and yes, I produced it. It's, I cannot believe how big it became. It's a very strange feeling, honestly. It's like, it's almost like I need really to think about the moments where I was, when I was in the studio working on it because it almost feel like it's not mine anymore, you know. Um, I, I, uh, I received from Will uh, a link one day and it was um, this flash mob with Oprah in Chicago when, when she took the, the music for her show and they, there was like 25,000 people doing that choreography on, on the music and I was, uh, I was crying in France in front of my computer seeing that because, you know, it's, I don't know, it's just unreal. You know, it's funny because the idea when we, when we made that song was like, I met with Will and we're like, oh, we're going to create a new music, you know, something like we're going to bring together your community and my community. And because, you know, I come obviously from the electronic world and him with a hip hop background. And it's so much bigger than that. You know, it's really it's not even about communities anymore. It's just everybody. And it's just a, a song that makes people feel good and happy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, I don't know. You know, when... Well, we did feel something like when we, when we made the song, I was like, oh my God, oh my God, this is huge, you know, but for me, huge was already, you know, having a number one record was already huge, but to create something that is like, it's more than a, a number one record, you know, it's, it's, it's just crazy, you know, like, cause I'm, um, um, what, and especially for me, because this is America, and um, I had uh, a lot of number one records in Europe before and other countries of the world, but my sound was always kind of difficult because then dance music in America has never been as big as in the rest of the world, and this is changing now, and this is why I'm so thankful to the piece because, um, you know, it, it said to everybody, to every radio station, it's, it works, you know, and then, you know, I came with um, Sexy Chick, and again, you know, huge, not like, like that, but really, really big, and uh, I think we, three, number one, uh, we number three of the airplay right now in America, it's been number one in Europe for a very long time, um, and Keisha now, you know, a lot of things are changing, uh, in America right now, so it's it's um, very exciting to see like a new sound emerging like this and to be part of it. I'm I'm really happy. Well, honestly, you know, um, dance music is huge everywhere except America. So it was like I was like on a crusade, you know, to make it here because it's it, it, it's such a big deal and and you have. Um, uh, you have artists that are so talented here, so it's it's very funny because I invited a lot of amazing artists on my album One Love. Um, you know, people like Neo and and Akon and the Black Eyed Peas, uh, Estelle, uh, Kelly Rowland, of course. You know, and 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 Kid Cudi, all those guys. But they came because they loved my music and they just wanted to have fun with me. But none of them believe that it was going to be so big right. and and this is probably why the album um is what it is and really makes the people feel good is because we just had fun creating the album because it was not it was not like a big deal for them it was not like you know when a huge artist like this um makes a single for his album it's a lot of pressure, it's, you know, <clears throat> because they've been so successful before and they want to keep that level. And when they came working with me, they were like, we don't care, we just want to party and have fun, you know, uh, we love dancing on, on David's beats and why not, you know, it was more that spirit. And, and finally, everybody's like, wow, we had fun and it works. So now everybody is going into that direction and, and I'm really happy about what's going on with dance music in America right now. I've been very successful since, let's say, 
I mean, in France, I was always very big, but uh, internationally, it's been, let's say, seven years that I'm really successful as a DJ and and now as a producer. No, oh, it's a very new situation for me, like to have all those huge artists calling me and asking me from for some tracks. It's it's fantastic because my the biggest pleasure and and it, for me, what makes me the most happy is to be in the studio with talented people. So, you know, to have all those opportunities right now, it's it's really a dream. You know, it's it's for me, it's not about the fame. It's really that feeling because those those artists that take my music but they sublime it you know they 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 put it up there and and they bring something that I could not bring on my own and I, I guess it goes two ways you know I bring them something they don't have and they give me something I don't have and it's just it's one plus one is three and 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 I love when I feel that you know I actually met a few uh, underground records before but my first I said successful record was with uh, Chris Willis in 2001 and um and you know then I had a really big success called um uh, Love Don't Let Me Go uh, in Europe it was really really big uh, but not here in America and then um uh The World Is Mine and and Love Is Gone and then Love Is Gone there was something in in America for the first time, you know, the record was being played on the radio, not in every city, but like New York, Miami, Los Angeles, you know, Chicago. Um, and uh, and what was very interesting is that the record was being played, of course, in every club, but also in hip hop clubs. And that was something very new to have a record that was electronic being played in a hip hop club. and. This is how a lot of those artists started to speak about me and knew me. And Will I Am and Akon and 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 Akon the first time I met him, he told me I always in all my concerts I play uh, Love Is Gone and um and same with Will when he called me he wanted that guitar sound cuz the guitar sound that I've used for I got a feeling is the same that the one that is on on Love Is Gone on oh, no. Uh, yeah, Love Is Gone, sorry. So, um, it's a, it was a very important moment for me. I think it was like a, a first foot in the door uh, for America, but I never, never could imagine that it was going to happen what is going on right now. It's just crazy. Oh my God. So much fun. So much fun. Um, first, I was extremely nervous. Because you have to understand that the way I produce my music is most of the time on my laptop. Uh, I'm making a lot of tracks on planes and hotel rooms when I'm touring as a DJ. Um, very often in home studios with friends. It's not like a really professional way to do it. Like, you know. So my first experience being with Will, he selected that track and I went to um, uh, finish it with him. Uh, in Los Angeles and huge studio you know the peas were there and everybody was there in the studio because what we were doing was sounding so different that all the other artists that were working in the other studios just came checking it out you know like oh what's this you know and and it was like Puffy and Buster Rhyme came in uh, Pharrell Williams was there you know and I was under so much pressure, you have no idea. My legs were shaking, I was sweating, I was like, oh my God, oh my God, all these huge people, you know? And um, and after a moment, it just turned to a party. And uh, we started dancing in the studio and screaming. And, and from that moment, you know, it was like bam, 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 bam. We were just making tracks and tracks and tracks, you know? And we made tracks for my album too, and it was just so much fun. And so we like kids when when we're in the studio together with Will. It's it's really, yeah, exactly. I could you know we jump jump on the on the chairs and and, and go crazy. <laughs> <laughs>